welcome to laptex and my name is nasir and today i am going to show you that how you have to program ec bios it means kb9012 a3 or a4 this is a dell motherboard dell 3521 and the part number is la9104p it comes with the different part number as well la9101p and uh, it comes also with i4 it means uh, four generations with different part number la9982p to program these ios you need a different programmer it is rt809f serial programmer earlier it used to come super pro flash pro mini pro many models were there in the market but now to program e any uh, you need this specific programmer and with this programmer you will get a holder with eight pins and with this with this eight pins you can program this ec bios it means uh, kb9012 uh, you can program it let me tell you the important pins where you have to connect it first of all you sold all eight pins here over here you all eight pins with a wire like this types of wire you can use individually you have to connect on the eight pins and you have to connect it on the io but it is really difficult to connect on these thin pins because it will uh, come together now what you have to do all these connections which you have to sold here which you have to connect on the programmer it has come on the keyboard connector on the keyboard connector there are some specific pins which i am going to tell you that you have to connect it on the jkb so first of all what you need you need a schematic diagram and you have to go on the jkb and there are the the pin configurations has been given here and now what you have to trace the first number pin there are the u type count anti clock when you count it there is the one pin 2 3 4 5 6 7 eight pins has been given here what you have to do that the pin number 1 always you have to connect with ksi4 the ksi4 on this specific model on the 27 number pin remember one thing that you don't have to connect always the one number pin on the 27 because you have to trace only ksi4 where has it gone it means maybe that it is on the pin number 2 12 and maybe 30 anywhere it could be in the different model has the different pin configurations so in this 3521 uh, motherboard has ksi4 on the pin number 27 i hope that you are getting it and you are able to see it now <coughs> and the on the pin number 2 you have to connect ksi4 ksi sorry uh, on the pin number 2 you have to connect ksi7 ksi7 is on the pin number 29 and i have connected pin number 2 on the pin number of this motherboard pin number 29 three uh, number pin of this you don't have to connect anything at all on the four number pin you have to connect with ks03 to ground this is the very important pin which uh, allows motherboard to read or write the controller io so now you have to do a uh, very careful to connect this uh, connection because whenever you are going to run this program the error message will come again and again now what you have to do you have to connect ks03 to ground it means the ks03 it is i think here pin number 16 the fourth number pin you have to connect on pin number 16 of this motherboard and the same time you have to connect it on with the ground it means k is 03 to ground you have to you have to make a connection from the fourth number of this folder pin to 16 number pin of this motherboard as well as with the ground understand and for five number pin with ksi6 now ksi6 sometime it will be quite difficult to connect 
uh, sometime what does happen the TP the testing point uh, connect with this wire and sometimes the two pin comes together so the error message you will receive however no difficulties to connect uh, you will not lose anything uh, the no short circuit will be take place but the error message again and again you will get now the five number you have connected it means I have connected on the KSI 6 on the KSI 6 on the pin number 28 of this motherboard and pin number 6 KSI 5 KSI 5 I have connected with 25 number pin of this keyboard pin number 8 is always 3.3 volt which you can take anywhere nearby a controller IC there are usually two coils is found let me show you here is the LE2 and LE1 one is uh, gr ground and the second is 3.3 volt usually in each and every motherboard I have seen these two coils has been given one for the grounding and one for the 3.3 volt power supply so you have to connect the 8 number pin of this uh, holder with with this coil where the 3.3 volt check it before uh, making any connections and make it confirm that this is the 3.3 volt and this is the ground and the KS03 the KS03 which you have connected with 16 number pin do one thing take the 4 pin this one this ground the 1 2 3 4 pin is also make a connection here and uh, connect it with the, that coil which comes with ground which is connected with ground understand let me tell you once again so that you don't make any mistake because uh, I am selling uh, this uh, RT programmer as well as controller IO uh, in fact uh, uh, I deal in the all, all types of controller ICs and all the BG ICs so I am continuously getting the a complaint uh, from the customer side that your controller is not working it cannot work at all unless or until you program for this specific uh, motherboard you need a backup uh, to program this uh, controller like I have backup for three uh, three five two one two one and in this way you need different different like as you used to collect the BIOS the same way you have to collect the easy BIOS for the individual controllers individual for the individual models now you have connected all these connections very carefully and check it again and again and make sure that you have not made any mistake then you power it on I let me open this software Now here you have to write 9012 it comes ENE uh, KB9012 QF dash A3 also you can uh, consider it A4 because both are the same bias as far as my experience is concerned both are the same bias now select it what you have to do if you try to read it now the read error this is the not proper way to read it however it is reading but this is not the proper way because unless or until you power it up because 3.3 volt is always required to program any software any any uh, BIOS now I have powered it up and let me read it this is the motherboard where I have changed uh, the new IC and uh, the controller I was short in this motherboard and I need to change that controller IO and I found it is not getting on and uh, that's why I need to program it because I have backup for uh, of this programmer programmable IC and uh, I need to program before uh, before you know getting it on I have read it the read is complete uh, completed and uh, auto verifications has taken place and uh, after verification that IC is okay and all the connections are okay now if you are 
doing any work with customer motherboard like uh, if you are trying to remove the password with this uh, model you need to save this before erasing so you can take a backup if customer denied to repair the motherboard at least you can give in with the same uh, condition so take a backup here with any one, one two three you can write here save it however it is mpt bios it means the, the, there is nothing because this is a new bios uh, sorry new io let me erase it now the erase has completed and uh, you just read it once again to check buffer it must be mpt and uh, there must be ff as you know that ff means it is blank and now you can program it for any model like if suppose uh, you have a dot that your dell 5520 motherboard where the same ene is used and it is not working then you do one thing you you take this motherboard 3521 and you just program it and you just give program you just program it for the 5521 and take io and you can replace it in the different motherboard understand what you have to do you can program here for any motherboard it is ff now you check buffer buffer is empty and uh, now you have to program it open i have the backup of all these models dell 3521 and la-9101p open and i have selected it and now i have to write it and it is programming now what could i do here that as i opened it i could select here for any models where this 99012 is used i can program for that it means like i have the different models and i could program it for the different models understand like dell uh, 5520 i could program in this model i can program this but i cannot open it i cannot make it on because uh, the different model i have selected i have programmed over here it has programmed here now check the buffer it is programmed fulfilled and now you close the program let me repeat once again that where you have to make all the connectivities there are eight pins has been given here and you just sold a wire like this like this you have to sold a wire so that you can connect with the keyboard connectors to read the controller io to read kb9012 so the let me repeat once again what you have to do the pin number one of this holder you have to connect ksi4 you can make it down you can write it down anywhere because this is the thing which is important for each and every model and you can read and write you can program anything so what you have to do the pin number one you have to connect with ksi4 pin number two with ksi7 pin number three you just don't have to connect anything and pin number four of this holder you have to connect with ks032 ground and pin number six sorry pin number five you have to connect with ksi6 and pin number six you have to connect with ksi5 and pin number eight you have to connect with 3.3 volt anywhere from the motherboard i think this video is helpful to you thank you for watching this video